America, we have a problem. We have a problem not from outside of our republic, but from within. There's a large number of people that don't want government, don't like government, and don't think government serves a useful purpose. They say they want smaller government, less regulation, and more tax breaks for the wealthy who they call the job creators. Smaller government, it turns out, means as little government as they can get away with. The current Republican-controlled House of Representatives has tried to dismantle or disable almost every federal agency that provides any services for the average American. They would remove protection from bad foods, polluting industry, and monopolistic banks. They would eliminate protection of the elderly and less fortunate by Social Security, Medicare, and Medicaid. They would halt or weaken infrastructure repair, worker safety, unemployment insurance, nuclear safety, affordable health care, education, and on and on. Like Visigoths, Huns, and Vandals, they have descended on Washington. They have no appreciation of art or culture. They demonstrate a profound ignorance of history. Their goal is the destruction of the state. They brandish their weapons and speak of revolution. They refuse compromise and adopt inflexible positions in the hope of governmental paralysis. What our enemies couldn't do, the people we elected are doing. Our government is being destroyed from within. When the last person leaves Washington, please turn out the lights. And welcome to the dark age of the United States. Life would go on without the federal government. I say... Shut it down. Then I say shut it down. We will say shut it down. Republicans do not need to shut it down. For this increase in debt. If I haven't been clear enough yet, let me say again. No compromise.